Hi, I'm Nachielli and today's tutorial we're gonna make this amigurumi dolphin. Uh, so this is a pattern from my collection of Brazilian animals. I'm Brazilian and this is like one of the most amazing animals <laughs> uh, that I think uh, we have in Brazil. Uh, it's called Boto Cor de Rosa. Uh, it's like a, it's a, like a pink dolphin. But it's not really a dolphin, it's like special. Uh, it's like it has this little bit different shape. But if you make it uh, in gray, it looks like a dolphin. It's really similar to dolphins. It's just not exactly the same. I'm gonna make it in gray in the video as a dolphin, but it's actually this uh, different animal, which is Botuco de Rosa. And it's a no sewing needed, so it's all crochet from top to bottom. This whole pattern we do all with different stitches and crochet, and we don't have to sew in anything. So this one I made with a four millimeter hook, and the one I'm gonna make in the video, it's uh, with a three millimeters hook. So, uh, if you like to check out my other pattern, so this is a capybara that I made also, and uh, it's another Brazilian animal. So you can see the difference. This I made with a four millimeter hook, and this one with a three millimeter hook. It's the same pattern. So uh, without further ado, let's get started. So the written pattern, I always leave, leave on the description box. I don't know what is making so much noise, <laughs> I'm sorry. So we're gonna start by doing a magic ring. Leave down long tail, cause I use it to mark. So we're gonna start by doing a magic ring and we're gonna make eight single crochets on it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Eight sing single crochets. So that's the end of round number one with eight stitches. So we're starting from the this part so this is the first round we made so now for rounds two to nine we're just gonna make eight single crochets so we're gonna repeat what we did for nine rounds for the video not get too long i am not gonna make all of that in camera it's just doing eight single crochet after eight single crochet um, to make the nose. <laughs> Would you say that a nose? I don't know. So yeah, it just makes single crochets all around up to the marker. And we're gonna make that for eight rounds. So you see, like I did here, we're just gonna continue doing that for eight rounds. The one we did before, and we eight rounds. So from rounds one to nine, we have eight single crochets. So I'm just gonna keep doing rounds eight with eight single crochet. So I'm gonna pause the video, can pause it too. So you do up to round number nine. So, and then we start round number 10 together. So there you go, I made here uh, rounds one to nine with eight single crochets. And now we're gonna start round number 10 by increasing three times. So one, increase, I'm gonna put through my marker here. Two, 
statue increases and a third increase right here so that's the start of num number 10 and then we're gonna do five single crochets so one two three four and five So I finished this round, that was round number 10, with uh, 11 stitches. Now for round number 11, we're going to start by doing one single crochet. And now we're going to increase four times. So we're going to start doing this, his face, <laughs> you see, this part here. So four increases so increase one time oops two three and four times so one single crochet for increase and now we're gonna finish with six single crochets so one two three four five and six so we finish round number 11 with 15 stitches now for round number 12 we're just gonna make 15 stitches so 15 single crochets without any increase or decrease just single crochet after single crochet up to we get to our marker so we're starting to make its face Uh, so this is actually my favorite animal, animal uh, like in, uh, in the whole world. <laughs> I'm a biologist, so I love animals, but this is my favorite one. It's like I can't quite believe it's real, that it, it is like a pink, naturally pink animal. I love it. I think it's just so cute. So I finish round number 12 with 15 single crochets and now I'm going to start round number 13 with 3 single crochets. So uh, what, what's your favorite animal? Leave down in the comments <laughs> so I know. Maybe I don't know the, your favorite animal. So 3 single crochets, so 1, 2, and three single crochets. Now we're gonna increase four times. One, two, three, and four. Increases. Now you're gonna do six single crochets. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Uh, one increase, and one single crochet. So we got your marker here. So for round number 13, we're gonna have 20 stitches. For round number 14, we're going to start by doing four single crochets. One, two, three, four. Oh, it's just four. 
four single crochets. Now we're going to increase eight times. So one, increase, two, three, four, Six, seven, and eight. Eight increases. Now we're going to finish round number 14 with eight single crochets. So one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Eight single crochets. So now for round number 15, uh, oh yeah, for round 14, we finish with 28 stitches. For round 15, we're gonna just do uh, 28 stitches. So I'm gonna pause and make here just single crochet after single crochet one round with 28 stitches. So I did here uh, 28 stitches, uh, 28 single crochets for round number 15. In round number 16, we're gonna make 25 single crochets, and I already made mine uh, to get a head start. <laughs> So 25, so it's just a little bit left uh, to end the round. So 25 single crochet and I'm going to increase twice. So one, increase and two, increases. So 25 single crochets, two increases and one single crochet for round number 16. So we finish round number 16 with 30 stitches. And now for round 17, we're gonna just do 30 single crochets without any increases or decreases. Look how it's coming out. So let's do here 30 single crochets. So there you go. Now we finish round 17 with 30 stitches. So for round 18, uh, we're gonna do five single crochets. I made one here and put through my marker. So one, two, three, four, and five single crochets. Now we're gonna decrease six times. So one, two, three, four. Five and six. So we decrease six times, and now we're gonna finish with thirteen single crochet. So one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen single crochets. So we finish round number eighteen with twenty four stitches. Now from rounds number twenty uh twenty nine nineteen to twenty one we're gonna do 24 single crochets. Uh, there will be three rounds. So we're gonna make three rounds here, one, two, three, of 24 single crochets without making any increases or decreases, just 24 single crochets. Let's do it. So I finish here uh, my three rounds, rounds 19, 20, and 21. With 24 single crochets, now we're gonna place the eyes. 
So here we stop at round number 21. So between rounds 14 and 13 and 13 and 12, because some of it is going to be um, one and some of it's going to be the other. So we're going to go here. This is round 21. Now we just stop. 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13. So between these two rounds, we're going to place our eyes. So the smallest eye I have here is 7 millimeters. So that's, uh, oh, oh no. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to use. So let's do it. So I mark here uh, the rounds we're going to place. So it's going to be 14 and 13. And so we have to have uh, 10 single crochets, uh, 10 stitches between them, one single crochet, four increases, and one single crochet. So it's gonna we're going to find here. Let me get real close. We're going to find here where we have four increases. So there you go. One, two, three, and four increases. So four increases, one single crochet. So on the next one, we place the eye. I'm going to place and then I'm going to show you again. So now one single crochet right here. One, two, three, four. Increases one single crochet. Oops. There you have it. So you can see. Let me check. Yeah. That's it. So now I'm going to show with the needle. So here, where is it here? Yeah. So here we have one single crochet. Can you see that those two are together? So one, two, three, four increases. And then one single crochet here and then the other eye so I do that so you don't make it uh, you don't place it on the wrong place so there you have it here one uh, oh, no, not one the eye so one single crochet one two three four increases and one single crochet I'm going to place my safety lock and fill up a little bit his head and then we come back to do round number 22. So I place uh, the safety lock, stuffed a little bit and now we're going to start round number 22. We're going to start by doing the first fin. So what we do is We're going to do one single crochet, I already did. Now we're going to chain seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now we'll come back by doing one single crochet on the chain. Uh, we skip the first one, so we do on the next one. One single crochet. Now we're going to do... Uh, two half double crochets on the next chain so one and two half double crochet now we're gonna uh do two um double crochets on the next one so one double crochet and two double crochets on the next chain now we're gonna do a treble, uh, two treble crochets. <laughs> that was 
hard to say. So one treble crochet and two treble crochets on the next Oh no, actually I said it wrong. Uh, it's just one treble crochet and one chain and one treble crochet on the next chain. This is not two together. Uh, on the description I'll put it uh, right so you don't get confused. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna skip uh, one and we're gonna we're gonna skip one stitch here uh, so that what we did did it we're gonna skip the stitch and then on the next one we're gonna do one single crochet so there you have it you see uh, that's our first fin so now what we're gonna do uh, is that we're gonna do 15 more uh, now we did this one we, uh, this single crochet now we're gonna do 15 more single crochets so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15 single crochets. Now we're gonna do the second thing. We're gonna chain seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now we're gonna come back with by doing we skip the first one, so one single crochet, so one increase of half double crochet, so two half double crochets on the next chain, so one half double crochet, two half double crochet. Now we're gonna make one double crochet increase, so two double crochets on the next chain one and two double crochets on the next one now we're gonna do two treble crochet one treble crochet on the next chain and one treble crochet on the next chain So now what we're gonna do is, so if you continue to do the round here after we finish the second pin, uh, it's gonna look wrong because this one is turned down and this one is turned up. So to fix that, what we do is we turn around and you're gonna place her here behind. So here what we're gonna do is we're gonna skip one single crochet so there's where we are we're gonna skip this one and we're gonna do a slip stitch here on the front loop only so here is where we are this is the stitch we made uh, the fin so we're gonna skip the the next one and then here we're gonna just do a slip stitch on the front loop only we have two stitches two loops so on the front loop we're gonna do a slip stitch just do a slip stitch and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna hold it and now we're gonna do uh, we're gonna walk around so we did this one it's a little bit messy but we did this one now on the next one we skip we're gonna do on the front loop a slip stitch again and 
and now on the next one here we do a slip stitch oh I think it can be here yeah I forgot so here you have two loops so you actually it's the back loop in this direction you just take and do another slip stitch now we go back to where we were and we finish by doing six single crochets so one two three four five and six so now you can take a look and see that the bolt turning uh, going down you see the bolt downwards now so we finish here round number 22 with uh, 24 stitches and both our fins in place now what we're gonna do is gonna do three single crochets and one increase all the way around so three single crochet one increase three single crochet one increase we're gonna repeat that all the way around so we're gonna start by doing here one and placing our marker one now remember doing every stitch so we did this one so the one we skipped we do it so one two this one is the third you see so one two three one increase So this is five. One, two, three, and one. Increase a second time. Oh, my marker's burning me. One, two, three single crochets, and one. Increase. One, two, three single crochets and one increase let's remember doing the ones behind the fins so the one we skipped also counts one let me show you really close so this is the one we skipped where there is like the space so we gotta do it one two two three and one increase and one and two three and one increase By the end of this round, that is round number 23, we have 30 stitches. Now for round 24 and 25, we're just gonna make uh, 30 stitches. Two rounds with 30 stitches, 30 single crochets without making any increases or decreases. So I finish here round 24 and 25 with 30 stitches. Now I'm gonna make round number 26 we're gonna start by doing five single crochet one two three four and five now we're gonna decrease two times so one decrease and two so now we're gonna do one single crochet and 
we're gonna increase three times one two and three three increases now you're gonna do one single crochet and you're gonna decrease two times one and two now we're gonna finish with 12 single crochet so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven and twelve so we finish round number 26 with 29 stitches because we decrease four times and increase three so now for round 27 we're going to start by doing six single crochets one two three four five and six now we're gonna decrease once and now we're gonna do a triple decrease two times so what is a triple decrease I don't even know if there's like a, a real thing <laughs> it's just something that I do that it turns out good sometimes so what I do is a decrease we take two loops so a triple decrease is where we take one more loop so three loops here and then decrease so we're gonna do that twice so once and now again so one two and three stitches together there you have it now we're gonna do a normal decrease so a standard decrease so just a decrease and now we're gonna finish with 13 single crochets so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and thirteen so now we finish round number 27 27 with 23 stitches for round uh, 28 we're gonna do four single crochets forgetting to put through my marker so one two three four single crochets now we're gonna decrease three times so one two oops two and three single crochets now we're gonna finish with 13 single crochets oh yeah three decreases now 13 single crochets so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and thirteen single crochets so I finish round number 28 with 20 stitches now what we're gonna do is round 29 and 30 with uh, 20 single crochets so we're gonna make two rounds with 20 single crochets each round 29 and 30. 
So I finished here my two rounds, uh, rounds 29 and 30, with 20 single crochets and I stuffed the body a little bit. Now we're gonna make round 31. We're gonna start by making four single crochets. I made one already, so one, two, three, three, and four. Now we're gonna decrease twice. So one, and two and now we're gonna finish the round with 12 stitches 12 single crochet so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 11 and 12 so we just finished this round round number two, 31 with 18 stitches now for round 32 we're just gonna make 18 single crochets so just one round with 18 single crochets so I finished here round 32 with 18 single crochets now what we're gonna do is round 33. For round 33 we're gonna do two single crochets and one decrease and we're gonna repeat that up to the marker so two single crochet one decrease once two single crochet and one decrease oh gosh twice two single crochet and one decrease a third time two single crochet and one decrease a fourth time and we're gonna finish with two single crochets and so we're gonna have by round 33 we're gonna have 14 stitches for round 34, we're just going to make 14 stitches. I'm going to stuff a little bit more and then make my uh, round 34 with 14 single crochets. So I finish here uh, round 34 with 14 stitches. Now we're going to do round 35. I put a, I place a rattle in it and a little bit more stuffing. So if you want to hear something, is the rattle <laughs> I place inside of it. So now 34, uh, uh, 30, round 35, we're going to start by doing two single crochets. So one, two single crochet. Now we're going to decrease twice. So one, decrease, and two. And now we're going to finish this round with eight single crochets. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And four, I'm going to stop a little bit and do uh, for round 36 I'm gonna make one single crochet and one decrease and one single crochet one decrease up to the end of the round I'm gonna stuff a little bit more because now it's closing in it gets harder to stuff so We're gonna start by doing one single crochet and placing the marker. We are almost done. One single crochet and one decrease. One single crochet and one decrease 
one single crochet and one decrease one single crochet and one decrease so I did this four times uh, so by the end of round 35 uh, 36 we have eight stitches for round 37 we're gonna do two decreases so one oops what uh, don't go away one and two two decreases and now two single crochets what is going on <laughs> One and two. So that's round 37. We have six stitches on round 37. Now for round 38, what we're gonna do is, we're gonna start by doing two single crochets. So one, it's tight, tight now. One and Two, two single crochet. Now we're gonna chain six. Uh, just wait a little bit. I gotta check something. So let's do uh, our last round, round thirty-eight. Two single crochets, and then we're gonna chain. Six, one, two, three, four, five, and six. Now we're gonna come back by doing one single crochet, one half double crochet, um, three, three double crochet, so one. Gotta be careful here. So, so yeah. So this is one. So in the next one, one, two, and three. Three double crochet, and then one, one more uh, double crochet here on the stitch. On the stitch uh, that we made, the we chain where we chain. So here, uh, camera. Oh, so here we're gonna make we're gonna make one double crochet here. Oh no, not here. Here, at the middle of it. So you see this loop? It's not right in the bottom, it's here. And now we're gonna do one slip stitch on the other one, like this one. So one slip stitch, real tight. Uh, now we're gonna chain six again. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we come back by doing one single crochet, one half double crochet on the next, and three double crochets on the next three. So one, two, and three and one double crochet on the one we did it that would be this loop here 
and now one slip stitch on the same stitch. So now uh, what we do is we're going to leave a little bit of a tail and cut it out. Now we can pull this and I'm going to place the marker inside it. Now we're going to take a tapestry needle and just close it up because you can see here it's open. So now I'm just going to close by sewing this end. There you have it. So you close it up here. I'm going to tie a knot here. And loose the yarn. Cut it up. So there you have it, there's the back fins, there you have our dolphin, look how smaller this one is, so cute, and you squeezed right here, so you get this way. And if you do it right as I taught, the both fins are going to turn uh, down. There you go. Uh, your botuco de rosa. <laughs> oh, actually, a curiosity of this animal is that when they are babies, they are gray. They're just normal. <laughs> uh, and then when they uh, reach adulthood, they get pink, so they uh, slowly get pink, it's just super cool uh, to see. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, and if you like uh, to do other animals like the capybara, subscribe to the channel, and check it out, all my patterns. See you next time, bye bye!